What's going on guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Prime Media back with another Dokkan battle video. So I'm literally just coming off my live stream on the JP side for my summons on the guaranteed LR banner. So if I seem a little bit high right now, a little bit hyped up, that explains why. But you know what? We're now on the global version of the game, which I still have a ton of love for. And we're going to cover the news for the brand new New Year Celebration Part 1 that just began. But you know what? Before I say anything else, I know everybody's thinking this and a ton of people are wondering. So I'll tell you guys right now that Global will also be getting the Step Up banner with the guaranteed Dokkan Fest units, the guaranteed category leads, as well as the guaranteed LRs tonight at reset well at the time of this filming at least so for global players if you're watching this like right when it comes out you only have to wait another like four or five hours before that banner is also available on global and i will be doing summons on global as well so keep an eye out for a video or stream tomorrow regarding that but without further ado let's jump into the details for the happy new year 2019 celebration let's see what they have in store for us here we go and by the way, if you see an ID on the top of the screen, that's not my actual global ID. <laughs> my global account is currently on my phone and I didn't have time to actually transfer it over to my computer. So that's why I'm using a brand new account. So don't try to add that ID. It's like a rank one account or whatever. But anyways, moving on. Uh, Happy New Year 2019 celebration part one begins. Various events are available. Okay, first things first, New Year Dokkan Festival Step Up Summon. So this is the guaranteed um, LR banner. So on step five, it's going to be guaranteed LR. But essentially, the way it works is that step one is going to be 20 stones. It's going to be a full 10 unit multi. And it's going to be one guaranteed Extreme Z Awakenable unit. So it's going to be like Easy A Beerus or Easy A uh, Int Janemba or Full Power Frieza, you know, along those lines, the Strength SDR Broly as well. And then second step is going to be a guaranteed 120 Super Lead. So like Super Saiyan 4 Goku, Int Gogeta, etc. Uh, step three is going to be a guaranteed Extreme Lead, 120 Lead. And step four is going to be a guaranteed Category Lead, like UI Goku, um, SSB, Vegeta. Well, it was on JP at least. I don't know if it's going to be on Global. Like, I don't know if SSB Vegeta is going to be available on Global because he's fairly new on Global. So we'll have to see about that. But on JP, uh, Ranger 17 as well as SSB Vegeta were all available on that. And uh, the last step is going to be a guaranteed LR as well. But um, unfortunately, not all the LRs are on it. All the LRs up to LR Bardock uh, will be available. At least that's what happened on JP. Like I said, I don't know exactly what they're going to do for Global, but I hope that's going to be the same thing. Um, LR Goku and Frieza, LR Cell and I believe a few others possibly are not going to be available, but there's still going to be a ton of LRs that are available for the guaranteed. So it's still an amazing, amazing value overall. Uh, moving on, so grab the chance to recruit Extreme Z Awakened characters, um, guaranteed LR, and also fourth virtual Dokkan Ultimate Clash, so Dokkan Battlefield, that's good as well. Let's celebrate the upcoming new year and enjoy Dokkan Battle. Absolutely, man. Yo, this is such a great way to start the year. This is honestly like a lot of people are calling it a trap banner, but this has got to be the best trap banner we've ever seen in this game, man. This is a banner, a trap, that is, that I would be happy to walk straight into. I mean, I already did on JP, and I got two LRs out of it. If you guys are curious, go watch my video. I released it probably like an hour before this or so, or something like that. So uh, go check that out if you want to know what I pulled. And I pulled some good units, like <laughs> some really good category leads and uh, some good 120 leads. So go check that out. But enough self-promotion. Um, let's move on. So... Number one is Happy New Year 2019 login bonus. Uh, I haven't seen what the exact daily login stones is going to look like, so we'll you know take a look at that in a second. Uh, part two is going to be, or number two is going to be the special missions, part one. Now, it says part one, of course, because there's going to be at least two parts, possibly even three parts to this celebration. And uh, we'll talk about what I think the other parts are going to be in a second. But right now, we're just going to focus on part one. Number three is going to be a dragon stone sale. 60 stone pack will be available during the event period. So essentially it's going to be a 60 stone pack that will also give you an additional 60 stones for free now i don't know how much that's going to cost so i can't really tell you guys if it's going to be a good value pack or anything like that but it's going to be 120 stones in theory for the price of 60 but it sounds like it's going to be like a regular price 60 stone pack and they just give you an additional 60 stones on top of that when you buy it it's only available once now, I was hoping for some more packs overall, but from the way it's presented here, it looks like it's only going to be one pack and you, you buy it once and you're done. So a little bit disappointing there. Not going to lie, as a pay-to-play player, someone who's willing to spend money on good sales, 
Um, a little bit disappointed. Maybe there'll be more that maybe will surprise us. But from what I see here, it's only going to be one pack. So uh, yeah, that's too bad. Number four is going to be a New Year Dokkan Fest. Well, I mean, this is what I was just talking about. The guaranteed LR banner, guys. Global is getting it. Don't worry. They're not shafting us this time. And honestly, like, <laughs> this is kind of the real Christmas banner. It seems that way, doesn't it? It seems like this is the real Christmas banner because the tech hit banner was honestly... A pretty huge disappointment but this one definitely makes up for it i mean of course jp gets it gets it as well so it's not really exclusive like the hit banner is but um you know what i'll take what i can get at this point man i'll take whatever i can get at this point as a global player <laughs> number five dokkan events are all available that's cool that's cool um so if you need to awaken any of your you know 120 leads or category leads that you pull or lrs that you pull on this banner then uh you know you can awaken them because they're all available and we got some story events returning. We got the Strongest Rivals event, the Goku and Friends Are Back event, uh, the Tech Bulma event. Make sure if you don't have this Tech Bulma to farm her up because she's actually a very good tank for Super Battle Road as well as a very good drop character for those events where you can only use drop characters. She's actually a very good free-to-play unit. She doesn't do a lot of damage, but she's a really, really good tank. Um, so I would recommend rainbowing her. You can get all of her orbs for free as well on her stage. So definitely make sure to farm her up if you don't have her. Number nine is uh, Universe Survival Saga event comes back. Um, Tournament of Power Commencement. So basically all the Universe Survival Saga events appear to be returning. We also have a Universe Survival Saga category summon. Now these are good units except for the hit. The hit is like okay. He's not as good but this uh, Toko and this Dispo are both very good units, but usually, honestly, I wouldn't recommend people to summon on these. But at the same time, this is probably one of the best category summons we've seen so far. And uh, LRs probably are going to be on the banner. But either way, I, I'm going to say don't summon on this one because you want to save as many stones as possible for this banner up here. Right? This banner up here, you want to spend your stones on this. And then also save for Gogeta and Broly, which are also coming for Global too. So yeah, I would say skip this one for now. Um, number 13 is the Bio Broly event coming back, the Turles event coming back, the fourth uh, Dokkan Ultimate Clash or Battlefield, and number 16 is success rates in training triple. Like, who who actually cares about this? Who actually cares? What we want is triple or quadruple ranking XP. Bandai, come on. I mean, you did really well with this banner up here, the guaranteed LR banner, but I mean, no rank EXP boost is kind of sad. I mean, I'm just being honest. I'm just being honest. Uh, is there anything else at the bottom here that I missed? I don't think so. Yeah, okay, so let's go back here and see what this login bonus is all about. So I know on JP, they're getting four to five stones a day. And, uh, ooh, so it looks like it's not as good. I think JP actually has four to five every single day, but I could be wrong. Okay, so we're on the JP side right now, and it looks like they get five stones for the first login, four stones the next day. And then three, two, one. So they do get a few more login stones, but overall is actually not a huge difference. So it's not as bad of a shaft as I thought, but they do get a few more stones. All right, so <laughs> classic favoritism from Bandai, but that's okay. Um, it's not it's not that big of a deal. Okay, we're back on global now. And let's go down to the missions here and see what these missions are all about. Um, 15 special missions, one stone here, two, three, four, five, six and five here so 11 stones overall for the missions not anything crazy hopefully we'll get more for part two. Oh, 25 stones wait a second oh these are daily login uh these are daily missions so every single day you get one stone there and then for these missions you get 10 so overall 25 stones in total for the missions i guess it's pretty standard um and i think that might be it for part one so obviously the most hype thing the thing that people really really care about is this guaranteed LR banner. And if people want a recommendation for whether or not they should summon, I think it's a summon. I know that you're gonna, people, some people are gonna call it a, a trap banner, but it, it's, this, this is probably the most value for your stones that we've ever had in this game of Dokkan battle. So you can call it a trap if you want, but it's just such a good banner that I can't say it's a not, like I can't tell people not summon. Like honestly, it's, it's a totally, worth summoning <laughs> that's what i'm trying to say man like it's such good value that i have to say it's definitely worthy of your stones even if you're saving for gogeta and broly but the choice is up to you 
I'm not telling anybody to do anything. I'm just giving you guys the options and telling you what I think of the banner. And you can do whatever you want. Let me know in the comments down below whether or not you're actually going to be summoning on the banner. And uh, if you did summon, then feel free to let me know what you pulled. Because I would love to hear what LRs you guys pulled, what category leads you guys pulled, and things like that. Um, but aside from that, this is part one of the celebration. The interesting thing is that I don't see anything about STR transforming Super Boo which was leaked that it was going to be released, so maybe Super Boo is going to be part of Part 2? But if Super Boo is going to be in Part 2, then does that mean that Gogeta and Broly aren't coming for Part 2 and are going to be coming for like a Part 3 or a separate celebration or something like that? See, I'm kind of confused now, because I thought the whole time that Gogeta and Broly were going to be Part 2 and STR Super Boo is going to be Part 1, but doesn't seem to be the case right now, so uh, I'm not really sure what to tell you guys. But if you see here, I mean, part one ends on the 15th, right? The special missions and the, um, what else here? Uh, some other stuff end on the 15th as well, from what I saw. Yeah, the training, uh, ex training success rate tripled ends on the 15th as well. Which means that part two should start on the 16th. And six the 16th is when the Broly movie is released internationally, so... It would make sense for them to start that part of the celebration or that um, movie Broly, Broly movie celebration on the part two, right? So, I mean, I don't really know what to think anymore. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys think. I'll keep you guys posted when more information comes out. But for the time being, I'm not really sure when they're going to place the STR Super Boo as well as the Broly and Gogeta. I still feel like it would make sense for them to release them on the 16th. Uh, the Gogeta, or at least the celebration for the Broly movie on the 16th and Gogeta and Broly are still coming out at the end of January, and maybe they just decided to delay Super Boo. But um, I can't confirm anything right now. So that's that's what's going on. Just wanted to let you guys know, make sure you guys were all filled in. I'll, I'll you know hit you up with more information when it becomes available. But that's going to be part one of the New Year celebration for Global. I uh, hope you guys are hyped and uh, enjoy that guaranteed LR banner because it is so freaking good. Like I said, I will be summoning on Global, so keep an eye out for the stream or for the summoning video tomorrow at some point. You guys are freaking awesome. Thank you so much for watching. Happy New Year to everybody. Thank you guys so much for your support up to this point. I love all of you. Have an awesome New Year. May 2019 bring you all the, the luck in the world and uh, nothing but success and happiness for you, your friends, your loved ones, all those good things. And that's gonna do it. As always, if you like the video, make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel. If you like what you see, then make sure to hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell so that YouTube knows you wanna stay up to date with all of my latest content. And uh, that's it, that's it. I'm out of here. Hope you guys have an awesome, awesome new year. I'll see you guys in the next video. And I mean, I feel like I should say more, but I think that's enough for now. I'm Tiger with Tiger Africa Media, signing out.